A few weeks ago, I was working on a wall and I was putting up letters on the wall to, to make a sentence. So I'll take a letter and I would tack it on the wall and I would staple it. And as it went around one side of the wall, it was going around the side of the wall with the door on it. And I realized that it was getting harder for me to staple into that wall. And as I was sitting there struggling with the stapler, hammering it with the stapler, one of the maintenance guys came into the room and he started chaining the trash bags. Not me being a strong man, I had to act like I was getting it. He's like, you okay? And I'm like, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> you struggling there? No, I'm good, I'm, I'm good. Mm -hmm. He's like, you know, this is, uh, you know, it's harder to staple on this wall than it is on that wall. And I guess he could tell by the way I was looking at him that it didn't make any sense what he was saying. He said, because the wall that you're trying to staple on, this, this is the wall that has the door on it. They had to put more plaster on this wall to keep the, the wall from falling when the door moves in and out. So I realized that the plaster was there. It, it wasn't there for it to be harder for me to staple. It was there to protect me. The harder, the, the closer I got to the door, the harder it was for me to staple. That didn't mean I was supposed to stop stapling. I had to press harder. Some of us are at walls in our life where God has the door there, the door that you've been waiting on. And the reason why you're going through so much stuff, the reason why it's so hard for you to staple things into your life, the reason why you're going through so much hell in your life is because you're close to the door.